It's Kai77 asked, every time you rejected a guy, how much money would you make? Would you be rich or poor? Um, I would probably be rich. Only in the city where the heat is on all night, on the beach till the break of dawn. Welcome to Miami. Hey guys, my name is Kate. If you're new to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below or at the end of the video. And in today's video, I'm going to be bringing you a Q&A. And I'm super excited for this because I'm going to be answering some of your questions. So the first question is from E Rich XO. He said, do you consider yourself as question mark, what profession would you want to be? Personally, like my dream, like job, my dream goal, my dream everything, I want to be a professional YouTuber. But um, my like safe dream is I want to be a fourth grade teacher. And so right now I'm actually doing observation hours at an elementary school right by my college. I'm just like super excited to be a teacher, but like my dream job is to be a YouTuber. So multi fuck girls <laughs> asked, where do you get most of your clothes from? Um, I get most of my clothes honestly from like Forever 21 and Goodwill. I love thrift shopping. It's like, I said that weird. I love thrift shopping. It's like super fun because they're all unique pieces, they're no nothing's the same, um, and Forever 21 is just like super cheap, and it's like trendy stuff, so yeah, those are the main two places that I like shop at. I mean, I guess I would say Fashion Nova is too, but it's not like I have a lot of clothes from there. So Carly Cop, I don't know how you say your name, but she asked, will you love me forever? And yes, hunty, I will love you forever. Cheer Corn asked, What's one product in your skincare, hair care, and health care that you could not live without? You're gorgeous, by the way. Thank you so much. Um, I would actually have to say coconut oil. Literally, you can put that on your skin as like a moisturizer. You can put it in your hair as like a conditioner, like deep conditioner type of thing when you just like rinse it out. You can put it on your eyelashes to grow. You can put them on your eyebrows. You can put it on your skin everywhere. You can also use it as a teeth whitener. So honestly, coconut oil is like the best thing I cannot live without. Bruno DLSG asked, would you rather peel off your fingernails or paper cut your eyes? Oh my gosh, when I read this question, I was like, what the heck? <laughs> that is so like disturbing. Um, but I think, um, would you rather peel off your fingernails or paper cut your eyes? I think I would have to peel off my fingernails just because I want to be able to see well, you know, I don't want to mess up my vision, you know, I don't really care about my fingernails. Well, I do, but like, I can always like get fake nails or whatever. So, yeah, I would um, probably peel off my fingernails. Zara Tian asked, when are you coming to Belgium? Actually, I really wanted to comment back to you on this, but um, I've been to Belgium before to see, well, my cousins, they live in the Netherlands, and so we went to Belgium just to like visit and they literally, Belgium waffles like in America suck ass bro. Like Belgium waffles in Belgium are banger. They're like super good. It's like a cake. Like it's so sweet. I don't know if I'm going back to Belgium, but I wish I could because I love the little town that I was in. Like it was so cute. Randolph underscore the underscore red asked, who's your least favorite professor so far at Siwoo? And honestly, I've liked most of my professors here. I've never had any like bad beef with anybody. Um, I don't have like a least favorite and this is just my freshman year. I don't really know who like my least favorite professor is, but sorry about that. It's Kai77 asked, every time you rejected a guy, how much money would you make? Would you be rich or poor? Um. I would probably be rich. I'm not trying to be cocky or nothing, but you know, guys just slid, slide in my DMs all the time because I post, you know, pictures and like, you know, I'm really out there on social media. So I would have the same rich. KT Stay Trill asks, how do you feel about black gingers? Now, black gingers, hello. I've never ever met a black ginger. He's a black ginger. I'm not trying to be racist, but <laughs> he told me he was. Um, and yeah, I've never met one before, but, um, I think it's pretty dope, like, it's pretty unique, so, 
That'd be dope to meet you. Kelly Michelle 12 asked, what degree are you trying to get since you're in college? Love you, Katie. Love you too, girl. Um, I'm trying to be a fourth grade teacher, like I mentioned previously. So elementary education, that's like the major that I'm going into. Sammy Adnan. I don't know. Um, she asked, what are your talents and you're so gorgeous, sweetie? Thank you so much. So are you, girl. Um, my talents. Let's see. My talent. I mean, I would say editing is like a talent. So, yeah, that's a talent. What are my talents? I'm trying to think here. I mean, YouTube's kind of like a talent. Being confident talking in front of a camera. So, I guess I would say like YouTube editing. I can do this. I don't know if you guys can do that. But I can do that. I can't really think of anything else right now but those are like the main two things I would say. Ovo Jefferson asked when did you start YouTube? I started YouTube my sophomore year of high school and honestly like it's been a crazy journey. I've gotten so much hate. <laughs> it sounds so bad but like you know I got bullied for it like when I started. You know people used to make fun of me in the halls like um, so I started YouTube a while ago. I've like really enjoyed the journey so far. I'm super excited to like get farther in my career like with YouTube. Lil Rice Gum Jr. asked, I know I'm late, but what are your hobbies? My hobbies I would say are finding dope ass music. I love just like searching up new music, um, getting to know like different types of music. I really like being outdoors and like going on walks like exploring my area. Driving is another one. I do like makeup. That's like a hobby. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that's all the questions that I saw. I answered most of them. So yeah, that was super fun. I love interacting with you guys. Um, thank you to everybody who asked me a question. I really enjoyed answering you for you guys. And hopefully you guys had a fun ass day to date. And I will see you guys soon. Bye guys. Welcome to my Bienvenido